very expensive monkey decorated set. Uh, this is Sapna Bhavdani, formerly Russian but now back to Bombay with a very fantastic uh, koshik but he likes to be called Q. Q? I don't know. Let's just ask him. Huh? Who are you? <laughs> Where did you come from? Who are you? No idea. I am having this identity crisis. You know, what we were talking about earlier, yes. uh, uh, last century. Yes. That I'm very, very uh, confused about my age and my identity and name and stuff. Because I think I've been around for a very, very long time. Why don't you know me? I, exactly. Um, for all you stupid idiots out there who don't know this man and you might know your you know your current Johars and your Yash Chopras and your blah 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 because obviously you will not know the real um, the the geniuses why I'm saying that also because I need to kiss his ass because I want the soundtrack to his film really bad but um, this man um, he has done a lot of movies before these short films that I am not aware of. So I will not even lie that, oh, I am very familiar, uh, you know, you oh, of your work and, you know, you're really fantastic and blah, blah, blah. But uh, the one movie that I have seen, um, I am completely fucking blown away by it and it's called Gandu. That's right. And I think as a child, he was never allowed to swear. So he decided that when I grow up, I'm going to make a movie called Gandu. So every kid who sees it can say Gandu and their parents can say nothing about it. Right? <laughs> 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 I'm a two-year-old. What's your favorite movie? My name movie Mummy Gandu. Uh, okay. <laughs> But can you just tell us a little bit about, uh, you know, your film? I have seen it, but all these unfortunate, stupid fools who have no connections in life <laughs> have not seen it. I know, I mean, I, 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 can, I can tell you a reason why they can't see it, because uh, they can't. Because um, in our country, we can't show things, you know? We can't say things, and we can't do things, and that, that's something that's going to change very soon. And I think that's the first thing about Gandhi. That to make a film, you need money, you need this, you need Laura, you need Lasso. But here we thought that we have some words, we have some music, and we have the camera, we have the edit, we have a sound studio. Why can't we fucking make a film? And we made Gandhi. Because that's exactly the film that I would love to see in my language, you know, and the kind of films that have inspired me and my team. Uh, for the last seven years, what has been happening in world cinema and in the cinema around the world is, is absolutely brilliant. It's just an explosion of ideas and, you know, directors that I really admire. And, I mean, being from India with such uh, amazing color and texture and stories, man, infinite stories. Um, we thought, I mean, why not? I mean, this is, this is the way. Yeah, I Let's think, tell a new story, man. I think, you know, and, it's, and the thing is, it's not even a new story. It's just that, like, I truly believe nothing is new. Everything Absolutely. has been done. Yeah, but it's how you, exactly, exactly. exactly. what exactly. makes it yours. Exactly. But the it's fucking the same thing, story. Yeah. yeah, but people in India are so afraid. And it's not like they don't do it. Yeah, Behind closed doors, we are the biggest drug addicts. We are the biggest alcoholics. Uh, we, we fuck around all the time. Yeah, but we will not talk about it. Because people say what and I love the fact that your movie just breaks all of that. And, and it's, it's just the middle like class value system that we've inculcated since independence. And politically speaking, that's where the root of independent uh, art lies. You know, talk about the real stuff, which is happening every day to you and your neighbor. You know? yeah. And this is uh, the, all the story. The story of Gandhu is from reality. Yes. And the characters are drawn from reality. Yes. Apart from the five main actors, everyone else is real. The lottery store guy is really own, owns that lottery store. You know, no no one is acting. They're all playing the character that, that character which we all know very well. I am so blown away by you were the director. You were also the cinematographer, I believe, right? And you even composed the music. I didn't compose the music. The music was done by Five Little Indians with Gandhi and the rapper. And I have, I basically, it's a collaborative exercise yes. where they came in with the sound, I came in with the words, and we jammed and something happened. And you produced it as well? Yeah. Holy shit. And I'm just telling you, um, I, I mean, for me who have been back in India in the last eight years, um, to be honest, I, you don't have to give me the soundtrack here, but <laughs> there has not been one film that I have seen in this country that I have walked out and said, fuck, we have arrived. 
And I just, I, 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 I can't tell you enough that thank you, because in my own way, in what I do in life, my whole point is not to make money, but to start a little, little subcultures where people are not afraid to express themselves. Totally. And, and you have done this, and I, I, I don't know, and I know you won awards, and I know now you're going to Berlin Film Festival, but to me, you have done, beyond all of this, something which is very great for this country, is that you have, you're kind of, you know, in your own little way, leading ways for young little filmmakers to understand, hey man, it's okay if I don't yeah. want to do a band Baja Bharat or it's okay if I don't want to do Dil, Dilwale, whatever, whatever. It's okay! If I want to make a gun do, I'm going to make a gun do. And yeah, absolutely. It's about finding that reference and it's about finding the fact that you can actually make films about, films about anything. Yeah. And, and tell a story about anything. Exactly. You don't need to be scared yeah, of exactly. telling a story. And, there are, and also not so like particular, like a lot of people I think who also have talent but they kill it because they're so meticulous because I have learned at the school yeah. and the playing and there is a this and a drama and, a, and it has yeah, to be a absolutely. format and uh, blah 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 blah. blah, blah. Too, many, too many things yeah. stopping us, you know, if you break that down, if you make with gun, with all the technicals, like it was, it was shot without lights, it was shot without a script, the actors had to improvise and come to the dialogues on the spot and we would keep challenging each other, like the actors would challenge me to come and shoot me in the dark, <laughs> fuck you. <laughs> So that that sort of drive, drove the energy of the film that we were breaking all these dimensions of shooting pattern, how you construct a scene, you know, all the grammar which I'm which I'm aware of, yeah. and uh, I, I think it, it all boils down to that energy, that idea, the energy of the idea that you're you what you what you're doing is completely true, you know, what is you're not holding anything back, you're just giving it fuck you. Give it whatever you. Wish. That's the rapper, you know. That's the that's the guy who's using language in in the, in, in a way where it becomes a tool, you know. It becomes a weapon. Yes. So there's no violence in that. Yes. Absolutely not. Exactly. You've seen the film, but it looks like you know one of these French films with a lot of violence. You know? Yes. Where where would that French film be without a gun? Tell me that. Yeah. Take the gun out out of films. How many films will collapse? Just tell me that. So if I have no device like that, which is a cinematic tool to, to, to construct drama, to, to convince audiences to suspend the disbelief, how can you next tell a story on that level, with that energy, you know? But it's possible. Oh yeah, I mean, and you've made it possible. And I have to just uh, give you a little bit because I think you're fantastic. And if there's one last thing you can tell to these stupid ignorant fools out there who don't know anything about cinema, no, you're stupid, say it. I don't know man, I will say this one word. Gand <laughs> <laughs> And uh, if you can find a trailer of this film because it's so underground that apparently it's nowhere out there, but if I can find it, uh, we will just add it to this link so you can see what we're really talking about. Yeah, okay. Get out. <coughs> Tell Maya. Put it out.